What is up, Apex Nation? Welcome back to some more Black Desert Online. So, I think we're doing this one? Talk to the Vigilante on Vela's shore. But now you're saying it's 15-something meters that way. That does not make sense to me. What the crap is happening? Okay, I guess there's two of them. Collector of the Forgotten Shore and Noisy Shore. Okay, I don't know. That quest thing is being weird. But anyway, we're going to do this one. It's the event. We're working on the event. Having fun with the event. Oh, that's a cool red horse. I like that. We have another key. Because it's a new day. As you can see, down in the chat, it does say I got a key. So we have to open another chest. Because we... Uh, okay. People aren't spawning in yet. Okay. All right. What do you have to say, shoulder? Shoulder? Y your shoulder. Uh, be careful. You might get hurt if you get too close. Okay. What you got? Mysterious creature. What kind of place is the Great Ocean? I can't believe it's a place where those huge monsters roam. I hope it's not a bad sign. Is the chief... Is the chief still not here yet? Can you tell the chief about these weird creatures? I don't know. I mean, possibly. Can you? Thank you. Expression. Uh... Why did you not instantly put that quest thing up for me. <laughs> Whatever. We can do it. Oh, that's why. Okay, never mind. Well, hang on. I'm going to change that. When I collected the thing, it told me... What is that? I want it. <laughs> I want that. Uh, What are you? We'll take that, too. I want to put that stuff in my... Oh, no, I also want those. Uh, I want to put it in the warehouse. But inside the storage here in the warehouse, you have silver, which you're not supposed to have. It's supposed to be inside my warehouse. Now, my inventory, I cannot put that stuff away. Really? Put that away? I can't put that away. Well, that sucks. Okay. Back to you. I'm gonna keep those on me. What do you do? Use this blackstone to perform a guaranteed enchantment on a green gear grade enhancement 13 to 15. Green gear. What's my gear? Can't tell. What's my gear? Orange. Okay. But anyway, we got this. Yes. We got this. Yes. That was good, but. It's it's something. Those could be sold. Alright. Uh, we're okay. What are you? Oh. Well, right click that. Get that. We're a ways away from going to do that. That's a little bit far away. I, mean, I don't know. Let's get, just continue, shall we? We will do questing. Do, 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 do. do. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I know exactly where this chief guy is. Hi! Oh, ah. time Have you I also seen it? I heard it, it had translucent blue scales. I've seen a lot during my adventures back when I was young, but I've never seen anything like this. Treat the villagers as you treat like them. to be treated. Okay, uh, fish in the great ocean. You must first identify its unknown creature by looking at it. Just by, just by looking at it won't help. If Vela's wisest and most knowledgeable person, Alston, was here, he would probably know something. Go and ask Alton's house regarding the investigation. You have another quest, investigating rumors. I recently heard rumors of a bizarre creature appearing on the coast. However, there's stuff I can do in nearby islands. If you don't mind, could you visit? No! No. I cannot. I could do the event. But I thought he said he wasn't here. He's right over there. If our greatest mind was here, he could do things. He's not here. Can you go find him? Yeah, he's right over here. Literally, in your village. Look I don't know what was up with that. But they said he wasn't here. I mean, he's right here. He's not far. What up, dude? A greater world awaits your discovery. That's nice. The shore was noisy, so I went and came confirmed it myself. I found something amazing. You came at the right time. Of course I did. Come look it's always important. Nope, not going to finish the sentence. 
Records of Vel's Heart. As you can see, excuse me, <laughs> sharp glittering scales and a triangular head. It's exactly the same creature depicted on the page 359 of History of the Ocean. Look at this. The detail drawn. Isn't it amazing? Well, I mean, show me it and then I can possibly tell you. Oh, I've done it. I just saw the page thing. I clicked on it. Records of Vel's Heart. Experts from a diary left by the first alchemist who visited Mongorilla. Among the contents regarding huge monster Veil, vale, we've heard about that before. These description of Veil's fragments, translucent light blue scale, triangular head, and sharp fin. They are part of the huge monster Veil vale, and are called loopters. Our records of the Veil vale heart say they can be processed into alchemy stone and it contains great power. But one day, research on Veil vale can come to a halt at the Veil's disappearance in the ocean. The time spent on exactly. The thing that appeared in the ocean is definitely Val's fragments. In, in other words, there's a possibility that the sea monster Val has reappeared and we must focus on this phenomenon. A greater world awaits I don't know what discovery. any of these are. Is that knowledge I can actually get? Come look for me often. I think it is. Your own good. Accomplishments what do you have? Not made through Loopster scales. Stories regarding the alchemy stones are uh, Lucifery written and it's a pity that we currently don't have a way to collect Val's heart. But there's one thing we can research with Val's fragments. There's something written here uh, about making a fine powder using loopster scales. Go collect loopster scales and give them to me right away. I will show you something very interesting. The time spent on conversation and inquiry. Alright, we can go get loopster scales. Do, 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 do. Correct. Oh, did I get his scales? Collect loose scales complete. But it doesn't say all of them are complete. Complete, complete, there's still one more. One, two, there he is. There we go. We got all three. We'll bring him back to this dude. And he's gonna show us something interesting. What will that interesting thing be? Yo. A greater world well done. Awaits your discovery. That's nice. Come look right. for me often. What do you have? Fine powder. Oh, How nice. With the scale from the loopsters, the rest of the material wouldn't be difficult to get, so I can make it right away. And while you were gone, I looked further into the book called History of the Ocean. Here, in the last chapter, I found something interesting. The immortal monster. Have you heard of it? Nope. What is that? What's it do? Restores ten durability. Minimum with two fine powders per try are required to fuel Vel's heart. Wait, what? Material to recharge heart of Vel. I don't know what that is. Okay. Accomplishments of oh, made 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 Immortal Sea Monster. The Immortal Sea Monster is referring to Vel. It is written in the diary of the alchemist who once used Vel's heart to create an alchemy stone. Even after he apparently took Vel's heart, a few days later, Vel roamed the ocean once again. Interesting. It does not... It should be impossible. Without a heart, does it mean its heart regenerated? That's kind of cool. An ability to regenerate the heart. It's, that's just amazing. There's nothing more interesting than this if you're studying internal life. The time that's, spent that's on conversation a good point. And if Vel appeared in the uh, Vel's in appears, if Vel appears in the ocean, we have to concentrate on Vel's heart. Although past research was interrupted based on its record, if we take a step forward and approach the unknown sea, its life forms will be known. Well, we will be able to learn from its life. It's unknown. Whatever words. Well, here is a complicated. Here is a completed. Vel's fine powder created to use the loopster scales. It's my first time making something like this. I hope this item becomes a medium for you to take a step closer to the ocean. Always stay curious about new phenomenons. That's it? Okay. So is this like... Okay, so we've done two things recently. I think there were events, right? The other one was an event also. About these things. Is that something that's coming? Is there like... Vel is 
coming to Black Desert Online and this is like their way of prepping everyone for it? Is that what's happening? Or am I just not at that point or it's part of the story that I just don't know? Who knows? I don't. What I do know is we out of, we're out of that quest. And I wish this was all different because it's terrible right now. This is absolutely terrible. Uh, okay, but well, there's one underneath that. I want to know what the one underneath that thing is. Because I don't have that pedal. I don't know where those stupid pedals are. There's a quest below it, right? I don't know. Uh, what? Oh, my quests are right here. Okay. Yeah, Collector of Forbidden History. Oh, wow. These are all the etc. quests. These are like percentages done. Find the thing at the Ancient Ruins Excavation. Oh, yes, yeah, it's about the Yurza. So, yeah, we should probably go do this one. How far is it away? Oh, it's not far. Where is it taking me? Can I take my horse? I can. Yeah, I can take my horse all the way over here. And then we can go do that one. All right, I can meet you guys there. We're back. And I uh, found a chest. I must open it. Open it. Yep, whatever what I get. A wolf nose? What? Hi. You must put this on. <gasps> we have a wolf nose on. I must take a picture of it. Get out of the way. Hee <laughs> hee. Screenshot. There you go, there you go. On that side. There you go. You stay on that side. No. no. Rawr. I love it. <laughs> oh, we're so... Wrong one. I know. Press it. Thank you. We are so keeping that on. We got a wolf nose. All right. We're almost there. I'll bring you guys back when we get there. Check it out. We're here, I think. It's like this really cool place by the water, the ruins. They got like camels. It's all pretty cool. Excuse you. Ugh, almost fell off. Don't exactly know how to navigate this place. It looks like I've been here before, though. I just don't remember it. Definitely seems like a really, really annoying place. Yeah, I've definitely been here before. If I talk to that person, I'd be like, ah! Yeah, I agree. <laughs> she went, oh! Don't exactly remember this place or know how to navigate it. <laughs> I can't believe we got a wolf nose. That's funny. I don't know if it's like that was my third one I got, so you always get the wolf nose on your third one. Oh, I kind of remember this part right here, this little bit of the wall. Or is it like random? Do you never know what you're gonna... There's way down. I'm like, I'm gonna use the stairs. Or is it random and like you have a certain percentage to get certain things? I don't know. What I do know is I gotta talk to this person. You can like, you know, face me. Oh my. If it is indeed the key box uh what? It this is indeed the key box of the Medeja Royal family on behalf Oh yeah, that's right, we have a box thing. Yeah, okay. I have traveled here from Valencia with General Gaian Arth to survey the ancient ruins excavation site. That's good. I never imagined I would encounter such a significant item in such an unexpected place. Why was this ever in the possession of Elurza's servant? Oh. It must have landed in the hands of a wandering rogues, or the wandering rogues, when they were attacked. You are someone completely different than what I was just looking at. Request for the Prince's Eliz Asylum. The three days of darkness, it ushered in a new age for Medeja and the Brandern's dynasty. Ah, oh, this royal chess brings back memories of the old kingdom. Nuda Shin promised to lead Medeja's until until Princess Prince Barrett comes of age. I wish to believe what you have a thing here. 
Nope. I wish to believe he speaks the truth, but history teaches us that such promises are kept in vain. It's only citizens of love. It's the. It's only the citizens love for the old kingdom that has kept Nuda Shin ambitions at bay. I have no doubt in my mind that Naruda Shin will make his move before Prince Barid is old enough to ascend to the throne. We must find a way for Prince Barid to be guaranteed asylum in Valencia. The Valencian de Declaration is here at the excavation site. Oh, you're talking a lot. You're a historian, though. What did you expect? I intend to offer them exclusive excavation rights in exchange for the Prince's safe passage to Valencia. Could you please ask the Valencian de delegates whether or not the Prince will be guaranteed asylum in Valencia? General Guyan Arth is the best person to speak to regarding this matter. Oh, and on a separate note, I wonder if you wouldn't mind leaving that key box with me for safekeeping. No, it's mine. You can't have it. It's an item that carries great historical importance and would do well in my research of Madiha. I have a feeling I'm about to be put onto an escort mission. Dude, you got a panther head! Why do you not have a voice? Hi, I'm Garin Arth, General of the Valician Black Leopards. I see that the insignia that you are Rose of the Shroud Knight. Can I have your helmet? It will go perfect on my wolf nose. And my eye patch. I have heard a lot about you. You must visit Valencia once it's all over. I have a feeling I've been there. Consider it a personal invitation. So what brings you to this excavation site? Complete. That's what brings me there. Alright, uh, the ancient runes expert. A request from the Prince Barrett's political asylum. I'm afraid that this isn't a decision I can make on my own. Before we could take this into take this to his royal highness, King Shahzard, Zahazard, Zahazard, it's only right that we find out the true value of the excavation site. I heard that the ancient excavation site expert, I heard that an ancient ruins expert from the south has come to investigate the site. Why don't you go ask him first? We can continue our discussion afterwards. Uh, T. Nope, T don't work. Is he above? Is he not above? Where is he? Can I just take a shortcut? Can you, can you? Can you, can you? I don't like complicated places. Okay, I think I found out one way to go. Okay, but is he down here? If Is my line gonna... Okay, my line is now officially moving. What up, Otter? Let's pants on. I think this is the ah, this is the right way to go. You have such a small nose. Ooh. Hey, dude. No voice. <laughs> ha ha! Greetings again. I didn't expect you to see. Oh, it's you. I recognize you. It seems our fates are intertwined. Tweened. Uh, yeah, you can give me knowledge. I'll take that. Surveying the excavation site. The historical value of these ruins is monumental. Monumental. Uh, they preserve the history of these lands. My goal is to restore this site to its former glory. Let me see. Where did I put those restoration planes? Hmm. Okay. I did it. I don't think I did. You want me to find your... The map is... Oh. I have done it! I think I did it. I gotta find more. Oh. Did I do it now? I did it! Okay, that round stone over there emitting light is a source of energy in these ruins. But the light is faint now because the stone is losing its power. These artifacts actually seal away dark energy. Once sealed, it discharges a, lo a level of light equal to the dark energy contained inside of it. The light, however, fades away with the passing of time as the stone becomes weaker like you see now. Come to think of it, adventurer. Have you been able to control the dark energy within you? Eh, 
kind of. In these lands, even dark energy itself can become tainted. Ooh. In order to rid Medea of the darkness spread by Eluza, Elaza, Elaza, I don't, I don't know how to pronounce her name. We must find a way to trap it, just as these artifacts have done. Find the dwarf known as Angrind at the ancient fissure. He is a guard. He is a guardian trusted, entrusted with protecting the dwarves. Butt sl slate, but slate, butt slate. I've heard that the butt slate possesses a great power. And can absorb dark energy just like these artifacts. If we can find a way to unlock its potential, we may even be able to seal away the dark, the black spirit that lives within you. No, he's mine. You can't have him. I beg your pardon. The value of the runes at the prince's asylum. I don't realize such a matter interests you. I'll look into it and speak with them. Ba -ba -da -bum. What do you got, buddy? Lock me away like some common criminal, ridiculous. What's gotten into him? You know, I always had a bad feeling about him. I say, now is our chance to show Eden just how strong we become. Nothing like a good beating to change someone's mind, he <laughs> he. What? You're actually going to go to that dwarf? Ungrid? I can't be sealed away, you know. You should be careful. If I go down, I'm taking you all, you all with me. Okay, okay, dude, calm down. Calm, calm yourself. Calm yourself. Ooh. Wait. No, come back here. Come back here. I don't know if I was in main or recurring. So uncomfortable. Okay, quest. Okay, we're in main. Advice of the Volks. Uh, bring out the gear's potential. It's difficult. Failure will find a way. Blah, blah, blah. Some say that failure is the mother of success. Who knows? Someone else's experience might be able to help you. It looks like someone's far away is ready for you help, to help you now. Let's find that person. Okay. Da, 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 da. Journey into a bigger world than we're in. You need to experience as much as you can if you want to face powerful opponents. The first step would be to go and get stronger, become stronger, and get stronger, and do stronger things. But physical training is not the only way. You need equipment that help you reach your full potential. We're going to journey into a bigger world, so you need to be fully prepared, when you say? Those are all in progress. All in progress. Recurring. I'm good. Reach 150 DP. I've done that. Great, now you have become better gear. Let's go test how strong you become. Okay. Well, that's cool. So, uh, now we gotta get out of here and go do whatever the crap they wanted me to do. Which I can't really tell. Oh, yeah, learned about the enchantment from the dwarf. Hard to see right now because the quest thing is all messed up. And I don't know if it's on my side, server side, or what. Can you, can you, walk? Oh, God dang it! Hate, 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 I, I'm, I don't know where I am! I don't, do they play test this? The walking up these things, I mean, they make them look cool, but I mean, if you can't navigate this area easily, players are gonna hate it. Well, at least I do. Like, granted, you're supposed to just press T and let it do its own thing and hit the shift button and let it run. And it will navigate for you, but, I mean, what if we want to? This is such a needlessly complicated thing. Whee! I mean, I have to go down all the way around here and then go all the way around? You just made this thing 500 clicks away. Instead of that 100 it was or whatever it was. No, 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 no. No, we're going this way. Forget you. We're not going all the way around. We're going straight there. This is why players can take control. Can you? Thank you. Just go. Let's go this way. This is better. We'll just jump. I'm fine with just jumping or just sliding down. Look at that nice, beautifully rendered rock right there. Rambling land. Oh, I wish I had a key. Alright. So... Where is this place? What the crap is that noise? I still hear it. 
I don't know. We'll ignore it. Kind of looks like where I parked my horse. No. Nope. Definitely not. Definitely not. If God, look at these ruins. What up, dudes? You, you practicing? What the? Okay. Okay. Whoa, what's happening? The arrow is like being drawn, or the, the, the path. This is something weird. This place is weird, man. This place is really weird. There's shiny stuff in here, man. Everything's all shiny. After a sh uh, harsh sandstorm, that's cool. This way? More shiny. It's all shiny. The book floating. Yes. Do, 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 do. Alright. Dude, just sitting down. I don't blame you. That's quite a hike. The ancient Hey, he's got a voice. Sight. They must be treated delicately and with respect. Isn't that the emblem of the Shroud Knights? Hmm. Did Eden send you this way? Marrow. You look quite inexperienced in the ways of enchantment. Hey. Alright, I'll tell you about my failure. Did I want to know about you? I thought you were the other quest. Oh, maybe they're both here. I've learned about this from the Valks of... In Calfion. In fact, experience of failure is such a valuable asset. There are those who conduct outside. All right, so there we go. The, this is the butt slate. Mountain. That's correct. The butt slate has the ability to absorb dark energy. The power of the slate were used to protect Medea for generations. The slate, however, has been extinguished. It has, has seen extensive damage and lost its power. We use the butt slate to try to contain the dark, giant black, stone, black spirit... It resides within. Ooh, ooh. So Eluza has got a big, a giant black spirit. Wonder what our spirit size is. But it was damaged during the process. This is why we're trying to restore the slate to its original form. The dark chaser. Uh, about the about three days of darkness in the butt slate. At first, I didn't know exactly what happened. Suddenly, the dark energy spread throughout Medea. It was then that a messenger from Tanto, the chief of giants, ran to me. He said that a giant black spirit appeared at uh, Elric Shrine. The black spirit that possessed Iluriza was what was the most powerful black spirit I've ever seen. Tanto's giants and human soldiers fought against them, but the darkness that possessed them was too strong, so we decided to use the butt slate to absorb the dark energy. Us dwarves had to move the butt slate to the top of Elric Shrine. It wasn't an easy task. In those three days, we had so many sacrifices. The big I hope you understand the what I said. Many things happened during the three days of darkness. It's a good habit to ask questions. Of memory myself. of the past. My friend next to me has a vivid memory of that event. He loves to share stories of his adventures to those who come by. The ancient ruins oh, do, 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 are a All right, so I gotta talk to that guy. We will. In the next episode, this is a good point to end. Good place to end. Ooh, look at this thingy. It's the butt slate. I found the butt slate. It doesn't look like a butt or a slate. Very misnamed. But that is all the time we have for today's episode. Hope you guys did enjoy. And if <laughs> look how ridiculous we look. And if you did, hit that thumbs up button and show your support. If you're new and you haven't subscribed for more content, feel free to share this video and comment down below. And until next time, I'm Apex Reaper. You all stay positive. Thanks for watching. Afraid of the dark? Are you scared?